Hey guys, Andrew McComb here, the founder and CEO of Golf University. In this Golf University tip from the pro, I'm with Gemma Partridge at Secret Harbour Golf Links in Western Australia, where Gemma's going to teach us how to get more distance with our drives. But before you start, and if you haven't done so already, I encourage you to subscribe and hit the bell icon below so that I can notify you every time a new episode is released. And if you stick around until the end of this episode, I'm going to give you access to our famous Golf University Skill Assessment, which has helped thousands of our members, just like you, find and fix the number one thing that's killing your golf scores, your handicap and your game. Plus, we'll give you free access to the specific video coaching program from one of our world-class golf instructors, so that you can feel more confident, consistent and in control of this area of your game. But before I help you find and fix this area of your game, let's find out how to get more distance with our drives. This tip from the pro brought to you by Golf University, the world's premier golf improvement program. I'm lucky enough to be with Gemma Partridge. She's one of the only female teaching pros in Western Australia and the female pro here at Secret Harbour. Gemma, we get a lot of inquiries on Facebook from the ladies wanting to get a lot more distance off the tee. What would you suggest for them? Yeah, sure, Andrew. Well, one of the biggest swing faults that we see in uh, ladies is that a lot of them will try and generate extra height and distance by falling back on the shot, and they'll actually try and scoop the ball up in the air and try and generate that height. Now, unfortunately, what happens there is when we set up at a dress, we've got the bottom of our swing, which is down at, at the ball. So when we're swinging back and we're falling back on the ball, unfortunately, our, the bottom of our swing is now moving backwards. So what happens is we'll generally hit the ground before we hit the ball, and uh, that's just not what we want. And chunk it, yeah. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> so what we want to see is taking a nice backswing and then transferring your weight into your left side for a right-handed golfer and really following through nice and tall, getting your weight forward, belt buckle facing towards your target. Can you show me? Yeah, sure, no worries. Wow. Okay, Andrew, I know you're not a female. Would you like to have a go? I'd love to have a go. Fantastic. So you're gonna take the club back as normal. Really turn towards your target, getting your hips through and turning your belt buckle towards your target. Okay, so basically I'm just really trying to get through and, and commit to the process. That's correct, yeah? yeah, really positive action. Okay. Fantastic, Andrew, how did that feel? Wow, I reckon I got 20 or 30 on that, yeah. extra on that. Absolutely, really turn through the shot really well, really positive action. It makes a real difference, doesn't Absolutely. it? Good job. Well, there it is. I hope you've enjoyed this Golf University tip from the pro. Put a yes in the comments below if you found it useful. Or ask a question in the comments if you need even more help. And, as promised earlier, we want to help you find and fix the one thing that's killing your golf scores, your handicap, and your game. So to access the Golf University Skill Assessment and free video coaching program, go to golfuniversity.tv forward slash golf skill assessment or click the link in the description below. And to help you feel even more confident, consistent and in control of your golf game, I also want to personally invite you to join our 19th Hole Clubhouse and Golf Channel. This is where our passionate and inspiring members belong to watch, learn, grow, meet and share inspiration as golfers. You can join the 19th Hole for free at the 19thhole.club or click the link in the description below. As a member, you'll have access to hundreds of golf lessons, travel episodes, and documentaries. Plus, you'll get member-only discounts on our golf schools, tournaments, travel, tours, and signature programs. And if you're a golf addict like myself, you can also join our members-only Facebook group by clicking the link in the description below. And remember, if you've enjoyed this lesson, or you'd like to ask some questions, or maybe you've even got a suggestion for another episode, then leave a like, and a comment below, and my coaches and I will do our best to answer them for you. And if you've got any golfing friends who'd benefit from this lesson, hit the share buttons below. And remember to hit the subscribe and the bell icon below too, so that I can notify you every time a new episode is released. Thanks for watching, sharing, and commenting, guys. I'll see you in the 19th hole.